hey you guys back again with another video today you guys before we start this video if you're not subscribed subscribe and thumbs up this video share me out you guys so today's video is a review so we are going to try out a review i just received this package today i'm wearing the same shirt from the previous video because it's the same day but i'm going to post these videos on different days love never gives up first corinthians 13 7 yes so we are trying a re um i just received this re um shipment from magic spoon um yes we're gonna try this we're gonna review it I'm going to give my honest opinion on it. Hold on, let me um check the air fryer. Be back. And I'm back like a snack attack. So, yes, once again, we're going to try this. So, yeah. I have a monthly subscription with them. But I forgot to reschedule this one. And it just, you know, this, this is sooner than I... Oh. how they come oh okay this is the one I wanted for the longest so we're going to check out the cereals we're going to check out the cereals so birthday cake this is something new I don't know if it's a limited edition but this is something new but yeah, birthday cake. Fruity. Honey nuts. Yeah. It better not have no nuts in here. That's all I gotta say. Better not have no nuts. It says honey nut. I haven't had honey nuts since, you know, another cereal. <laughs> and cinnamon roll. So, yeah. So, the one I want to try is the Honey Nut. But I don't know. So, this is uh, the high protein, keto friendly, gluten free, grain free, soy free, wheat free, naturally flavored, totally delicious, childlike cereal for grown ups. Okay, let's see what we'll give it the... So this is Honey Nut. Right there. I know I should have done this at my dining room table. But I just feel like being sitting on my couch. So, yeah. So I tried these. Um, I'm not going to do all of them in the video. Uh, I think the birthday cake and the... Honey Nut. So... Yeah, put these aside. I'm gonna give y'all eyes, eyes review on them. And this says what? What it says? Open sesame. Magic spoon. Okay. Okay. We're gonna see this together. this for the longest and this one says most bowls are round not every breakfast is well rounded yep, that's it oh, I always wanted that cute little bowl in there and a spoon it looks 3d it looks like it got little squares inside it. I don't know if y'all can see that. Look like little squares in there. 
That is so cute. And it's a, oh, it's a zebra at the bottom. It's a zebra bowl. I love this spoon. So, I'm going to wash these, and I'm going to be back, okay? Mm -hmm. So, we're only going to try two in this video. We're going to try the Honey Nut. Ooh, I got avocado oil in it, because you got to read the ingredients. I know I have to read the ingredients, because it, it, it my food allergies. So, milk protein blend. Uh, sweetener blend, uh, alicose, alicose, monk fruit extract, oil blend, high sunflower oil, avocado oil, tapioca starch, okay, natural flavor, honey and salt. So, I didn't hear no... I didn't hear nothing about the nuts. But. Okay. Who remember as a kid when I used to eat your cereal? I used to read the back of the box. Excited, y'all. Like a kid eating new bowl of cereal. But I'm going to tell you something. I don't have a lot of selections to eat for cereal. So, I'm limited. So, the only ones I can eat is rice checks. Um, yes, rice checks. And um, cornflakes. Not cornflakes. No, I can't eat cornflakes. Rice checks. Um, rice Krispies. So, yeah. I can eat Rice Krispies. The, the original one. Uh... And the frosted one, the strawberry one, the cinnamon and sugar one. So I'm, I'm limited, you know. I am limited. Where is that? Yes. So they should put on here corn free too. Because people is, and nut free too. Because people is allergic to nuts. Um, and people are allergic to corn. But I'm not really a cereal eater. I don't eat cereal like that. If I want breakfast, I go in there and make me a old nasty pancakes or waffles, sausage, my breakfast sandwich that y'all saw from the previous video, one of those. Um, grits, you know, cheese grits like that. Sometimes I'll have, like, lunch or or dinner for, like, you know, those meals for breakfast, you know. I have, you know, sometimes I want, you know, breakfast for dinner. You know, that makes sense? Like, you know, sausage, you know, um, my vegan eggs I make, grits, pancakes, like that. Sometimes I want that for dinner, you know. Or sometimes I want... You know, chicken and waffles for breakfast, you know? So, it's don't always be a bowl of cereal for me. You know, back in the days, yeah, I thought you needed, like, eggs, sauces like that for a meal. But you don't. or well, not all the time. It's like, basically, whatever you you have a taste for, that can be your meal. Sometimes I want a taco for breakfast. Sometimes I want a cheeseburger for breakfast, you know? I know I shouldn't be having that for breakfast, but you know it's good to have. And sometimes I don't even eat breakfast at that. You know, sometimes I eat like lunchtime. You know, I get up early enough to make me breakfast, but sometimes I just don't want to eat right away. And sometimes I make me a whole smoothie, you know. Sometimes I have me an avocado, sometimes I want a salad. It all depends. But let's get to it. Let me go wash this bowl. And we're going to try this honey nut. Okay. I'm going to tell y'all something. I've tried this one before. I did. This is my favorite one so far. 
that they made. This one right here gives me a Fruit of the Loops type of thing to me. I don't know what y'all think. But to me, those who tried the fruity one, this one gives me that. Is it Fruit Loops? It's Fruit Loops. Yeah, this one. And this is the closest I have gotten to Fruit Loops in years. And I can't eat the regular, you know, the other brand Fruit Loops. You know? So, how y'all do y'all cereal? How y'all do y'all? Do y'all put the milk in first or do y'all put the cereal in first? Everybody's different. Some people put the cereal in first. Some people put, then some people put the milk in first. Then add the cereal. Some people put the, the cereal in first. Then add the uh, milk. Some people put the milk and the cereal. I mean, the milk and the sugar. You know, cereal together. And this is zero total sugars per serving. So I read that diabetics can eat this. People who's trying to watch their sugar intake, but also still want to have, you know, a, a sweet cereal. But I know that fruity one right there is, is for me. So every time I get a shipment from this brand, I always throw in the fruity. Oh, did I bring this in? Who used to eat cereal out the bag back in the day? Like, <laughs> I need to come across a cereal that giving me Captain Crunch, Rob, you know? So this is how I do mine. I do my cereal first. Oh, let me smell it, huh? I had to check to see which one that was. So let's see if it's gonna give me. Uh, ooh, 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 whoa, 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 hold up. Hold up. This is supposed to be a sample. I didn't have breakfast this morning, but it's like lunchtime right now. So. Okay. We gonna try this. Let's say grace and get it in. Amen. Oh, I just hope it don't have no nuts in it. I don't know. My body would be like, hold up, you're allergic to something. All right, let's let's taste. You know what? Give him my honest opinion. Oh, oh, y'all waiting for me to tell y'all how it tastes? Give me a minute. I don't remember how honey, um, the other brand tastes. You know. Mm -mm. Hold on. So it says zero grams includes zero grams of sh added sugar. You got your protein. Ah, okay. It's two. It's two hundred and ten milligrams of sodium in here. I gotta watch out my own, um, my sodium intake and my sugar intake. But y'all all know how I like to throw down on some some cakes and stuff, right? Cookies. So. Salt and sugar is my problem. It's good, but it don't taste like no honey nut to me. <clears throat> it doesn't. It's not giving me honey nut vibes. I'm being honest. Would I still eat it? Would I finish this? <clears throat> But, I may come back in another video to, um, 
test the other ones because would I buy this again? <clears throat> no. So far, it's only one that I would buy more of. You know? And that's this one. <clears throat> so I may come back. I'm going to come back in another video. And um, try the um, fruity. Well, not try, but matter of fact, I'm going to try the birthday cake next. Edible glitter. Hold on. They got edible glitter in this cake, and it. This makes me want to open this birthday cake right now. Wow. Mmm. That sounds magical. Edible glitter. Yeah. I'm going to come back in another video with this. Not today, though. I won't have this same shirt on when I try that. But. I don't eat cereal like this. You know, so this will go. will be sitting around for a while. Unless I really do like it. Like the fruity one. I'm down one box already. I finished one box already. That's the only one so far that that's my favorite, Fruity. I'll come on on another video and eat the Fruity. And another video, eating the cinnamon roll. Why well, I feel like I got the cinnamon roll before. Anyway. But. Yeah. I'm going to come back with a. I wouldn't say a part two, three, and four because mm. oh, and I got another bowl from them too. I think it's the parrot one. I'm not sure, but I've been wanting this bowl for the longest. When I saw it was available, I jumped on it. Our next shipment, I may change it to all fruity. You know, the fruity flavor one, because that's my favorite so far. But I will come back in the video doing the birthday cake, and then the cinnamon roll, and then the fruity. Another video. I don't want to sit here and open up all these boxes. I should have poured a little bit of each, you know. I poured a full bowl. Mm. I mean, I wasn't expecting this to come, you know, this box. Because I've been holding this thing off for months. <laughs> it snuck right past me. Because usually I reschedule out. Not reschedule, but like, I'll, um, yeah, re you know, change the date. But, um, yeah. I got this shipment in June. But y'all be seeing this. In another month. So that's it. Do I drink all the milk? Yes, I do. But I'm not doing that on camera. I mean, it's good. That's, I'm not going to lie to y'all. That cereal is good. Because if it wasn't good, I wouldn't be eating no more. I just threw the box all left. I threw it, whatever. <laughs> okay. Um, my right. I threw it to my right. I don't know how y'all going to see this. But the Honey Nut Cheerio is good. But I didn't taste no honey. And I didn't get, like, no nutty taste to it. 
you know. But um, when you haven't had one before, you know, you can't compare. But I wouldn't buy that again, you know. Mm, have something in my teeth. Um, I wouldn't. I wouldn't buy it again. But um, yeah. Honey nut. Magic spoon. Um, my husband says it it gives it a medicine medicine-y taste. But that's what's going on. It gives it a medicine-y taste. That's what he said. Um, this one don't. But, um, yeah. But, um, yeah. I found this on, um, uh, where I came across this, this cereal. I think I saw it on Instagram. Um, yeah. Honey Nut. I even inboxed, I even messaged these people and I said, does it come with nuts in it? Because, you know, I have a, a nut allergy. So, mm -mm -mm. why, why we're special? I'm reading the box back of the cereal. Now, if I wasn't recording, I'll be like this. I'll be like this. And the crazy thing as a kid, when we used to eat a box of cereal, well, we we'll, we'll eat cereal for breakfast, we have the box of cereal in front of us. And no matter how many times we read that same box, each time we have cereal, we will still read that same thing like we never read it before. But I, I, I gotta read this. Why they're special. Why we're special. Do you ever wonder why you grew up but your cereal didn't? Magic Spoon reimagines the same sweet deliciousness of your favorite childhood cereal with premium ingredients, complete protein, and no glutens or grains. This box contains more This box contains more protein than a dozen eggs and fuel net carbs than a typical fruit smoothie. But it is so much more fun to eat. Okay. Discover limited edition flavors and products at magicspoon.com. Grab your spoon. Oh, man. Oh. Mm. I forgot I was recording for a minute. I'm sorry, y'all. Didn't I just tell y'all? I'm reading the box, back, back of the box while I'm eating my cereal like I do. Y'all, I'm sorry. I forgot for a minute. I was like. <clears throat> the the milk with the cereal, you know, left up is good. But um, if I didn't like it, I would let y'all know. But it's okay. But I wouldn't buy it again. Would I continue to eat this one? Mm. When I ain't got no more cereal left and I want some cereal, yeah. Okay, I didn't mean it like that, but yeah. Um, I did a review on this, but like I said, my mouth was fixed for something else to eat. But I said, you know what, let me do this video right now, you know, since I got it here. I wasn't craving no cereal, but I was craving some air fried chicken and cheese grits <laughs> yes air fried chicken and should I still come back with a video after this one eating the chicken and, and, and grits oh and I also want to show y'all something else that I got so I will come back I will mm, I will come back oh don't worry this is going to be gone Gone, gone. Gone, gone, it's 
gone. I know I said I wasn't going to drink it on camera, but I just wanted to do in the words of the Hodge twins. It's gone. Gone, man. Gone. I like these bowls. I'm into like pretty nice things. I like I like things like this. I'm, I love this spoon. This rainbow spoon. Yes. I love it. And I can't really see because of the rain light. Okay, <laughs> anywho. But anywho, if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. Join the channel. Join the family. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yes, thumbs up this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Get me in the algorithm. Get, you know, I'm trying to grow my channel. I'm having fun over here. It's like Melissa B says. I'm not going, I'm not, I'm not taking her life. She's like, it's fun over here. That's what she say on her channel. But, you know, I'm having, I'm having fun over here. You know, I love doing what I do on this channel, you know, and I would do this even if I'm not recording. I would really, you know, because I ordered the cereal, so I would still eat it, even if I don't record myself. So a lot of things I do on this channel, I would do when I'm not recording. You know, and that's that's my honest opinion. That's a good thing because I normally will cook. Even if I don't record myself cooking, I'm still going to cook. Because guess what? I still have to eat. My husband and my son still have to eat. So whether I cook or not, no, no, whether I record or not, I'm still going to go in that kitchen and cook, bake, do something, make something creative, you know? I'm still going to, I'm still going to try magic spoon you know but um i do eat a few bowls off camera so the fruity bowl that i have that i gotten already before but i just want to show y'all you know this you know me reviewing magic spoon and this is not a sponsored video which i would love to been have been sponsored but you know, this is good. You know, you can eat this. Um, it's safe for diabetics. If you're a diabetic or if you know anybody that's a diabetic or anybody that's watching their um, sugar intake but still wants to enjoy cereal, you know, tell them about Magic Spoon. You know, I already told my niece. Oh, did I have to say that out loud? But, yeah, I will recommend you, if, if you was... Okay, I'm going to give my honest opinion. I've been giving my honest opinion. But my favorite is Fruity. I will tell my niece about this. I'll be like, you know, try this. I may give, I may, I may order her a box or two. Or maybe, no. I may, because I don't know, everybody's taste buds are different. So, but yeah, this is safe for people that's watching their sugar. And, uh... Diabetics, yeah, diabetics. Yeah, I read that on their website, but yeah, if you're watching your sugar, uh, my husband is so silly over here creeping by. I don't know why he's creeping by, but um, uh, yeah, I like the fruity one. I'm keep saying that, that's my favorite. This take me back to my child. Is it fruity? No. Is Barbie breakfast cereal. I don't know if y'all noticed that, but this is what reminds me of Barbie's breakfast cereal back in the uh, late 80s, early 90s, that cereal Barbie they came out with. That's what this reminds me of. This reminds me of the Barbie. Yes. Yes. That's what it is. It's not fruit. It's the Barbie breakfast cereal. Yes. But I will recommend, you know, people who wants to eat cereal but don't want their sugar to spike i have to watch my sugar my doctor said i'm um what they call that pre not pre-diabetic is it pre-diabetic yeah but i'm not diabetic but i'm pre you know it's i think is that even the word but yeah so anybody that's diabetic can eat this cereal if you eat the recommended daily you know dosage like if it says one cup per serving don't go eating three cups i'm saying it's good there's no sugar added it has um oh 
It's the same one that's found in raisins, figs. Okay, is this is this um type of sugar, rare sugar is called allulosis. All the lo A L L U L O S E. It said it's a rare sugar found in raisins, figs, and maple syrup. So is that a natural type of sugar? Um, so it says here, okay, it says, okay, it contains only 10% of calories of regular sugar and it's only slightly metabolized by your body. So it barely impacts blood sugar levels all the while having the same familiar taste and texture as regular sugar. Monk, monk fruit is native to Southern Asians and was, excuse me, was first culturalized, civilized by Buddhist monks in the 13th century. So yeah, y'all, it won't impact your blood sugar levels if you're watching your sugar. But if you're not, you know, by all means, you know. But um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. And this video is way longer. That's why I'm going to do a, a box of video because I don't. This is an unboxing. It was a review slash unboxing, and I told y'all my opinion, and of course, it's long. But yeah. I got more space, y'all, to record. I got more space, y'all, to record. Hey, what is going on with this hair? Okay. Mm-hmm. So, with that being said, in, in the meantime, in between time, I'm going to let y'all go. In the next video I do, I don't know. I'm not guaranteeing you if it's going to be short or not. I don't know. It depends on my phone. It depends on if, I wanna, if I'm very talkative. And I'm going to be honest with y'all. I'm not this talkative in, in real life. I'm shy. I'm quiet. You know. If I don't tell you, you will never know. But thanks for watching. Bye. Stay blessed. Stay safe. Bye. Boom.